Anil Kumar sharing with you a test question on application of tension in a particular strain. The question here is, a portrait of mass 2 kg is hung such that the wires from the picture make an angle of 140 degrees at the point of suspension. Find the tension in each wire if the picture is hanging straight. So let's try to make the diagram first. That a painting is hung with two strings like this. When we say that it is suspended straight, that means these two lengths are equal, right? So these two angles are equal. That's what we're trying to say. And the force which acts downwards is because of 2 kg weight. So let's find this force which is equals to 2. Now we are given the mass actually. So we will multiply this by 9.8 to get the force. So 9.8 times 2 gives us 19.6 uh, newtons. So 19.6 newton is the force acting downwards. Let the tension in these strings be T1 and T2. Now we are given angle of 140 degrees here right in the center. So the other two angles are going to be 20 each right. So these are 20 degrees each. So from this situation let us first make vector diagram. So the resultant force is going to act in the opposite direction. So let me take this as resultant force. I'm drawing it slightly bigger so that we could work easily with the diagram. So this resultant force will be same as equal to this 19.6 newtons but acting upwards since it's a resulting force. Now direction along this tension will be kind of like this. So this is T1 and T2 is right there. The angle will be, let me draw a dotted line here. So if I draw a dotted line here, this angle is going to be same as 20, right? same as 20. So, so that is 20 degrees. Similarly, this angle is also 20 degrees. Now here we have 90 degrees. A horizontal meeting of vertical line. So these angles here are 70 each. So I hope the vector diagram is absolutely clear. Now from here we can actually solve the triangle to find the tension in each wire. So as you can see, it forms an isosceles triangle. So the magnitude of tension 1 is actually equal to magnitude of second tension. Both magnitudes are equal. Let's find the magnitude first. So we can use the cosine law. We can say this tension is basically equal to, or let's use the sine law first. Since in this triangle, we know one combination we can say sine of 40 degrees divided by 19.6 is equal to sine of 70 degrees divided by T1, the magnitude of T1. So cross multiply to get magnitude of T1 as equal to 19.6 times sine 70 over sine of 40 degrees. Correct? So let's calculate this, which becomes our answer. So it is 19.6 times sine of 70 degrees, and we'll divide this by sine of 40 degrees. We get 28.65. So the answer is that tension in each string, both should be same, 
will have a magnitude of 28.65 newtons right direction already shown here in the diagram so i hope the steps are absolutely clear feel free to write your comments and share your views thanks for watching and all the best